welcome to another edition of Moms on the Go, Cooking in the Kitchen. We appreciate you watching. Make sure you subscribe to our channel and click that bell. Today what we're going to make is shrimp lo mein. It's very simple. Your family will absolutely love it. If you like lo mein with chicken, shrimp, beef, either one. We found the ingredient on Facebook and it is going to be a review because we've made it several times for our family. So we decided to make it for you. So make sure you subscribe to our channel. We thank you for watching. God bless. Okay, we have our water boiling. We're going to put in a little bit of salt, a little bit of oil. And then we have our thin spaghetti. Again, I like to break the spaghetti. The noodles in half. So remember, we're making garlic, shrimp, broccoli, lo mein. So we're using shrimp instead of the beef. So we're just gonna take a little spin on it. We're still gonna give the recipe critic their props. But we're putting a different little spin on it. Pretty much the same ingredients, except we're exchanging the beef for shrimp. We've made the beef before, and it is wonderful. My family absolutely loves it. I'm going to go ahead and just make the whole bag. I'm probably going to wish I didn't. There's just a little bit left over because last time we had leftovers from the spaghetti. So again, this is going to be a review for the recipe critic we found on Facebook, one of their videos. My family loves it. It's garlic, shrimp, and broccoli lo mein. So I'm going to boil the broccoli broccoli with the noodles with the spaghetti noodles in a little bit but I'm gonna let this get you know done a little bit and then we'll boil the noodles mm hmm so I'm swishing this around you dig just so they don't stick together together little bit together And then I'll let this cook a little bit and come back and swish it some more. So we don't like our noodles stuck together. And then I'll put the broccoli in in a little bit. Okay, so we'll check our noodles. They're almost done. So it's probably been about maybe 10 minutes or so. So we're gonna take our broccoli. So we have steamed broccoli florets and we purchased this at Aldi. We're just gonna pour these in with the noodles. And then we're just gonna stir and mix those up with the noodles. Okay. So we're probably only gonna be use about two A pan and a pot so we don't waste too much too dirty too many dishes up you dig and we're just gonna let that steam up for a bit okay I almost forgot about the noodles and broccoli so it's definitely ready to drain so we'll drain it and then I'll put it back in the pan or the pot until later. Okay, I've drained the water. So we're gonna spray a little bit of olive oil 
on it and then I'm going to cover this up because I'll make the other part either in a little bit or later on and also add it don't forget to add just a little bit of your leftover water back in with your pasta so it doesn't get sticky so it it'll be it'll you'll be able to work with it a little bit better so you see I just have a little bit more and I'll pour a little bit more in there not a lot it's already poured a little bit just so it doesn't stick too much and I'll pour spray a little bit of olive oil and then I'm going to cover it up okay and I'm going to just when the stove is off and we'll be back you dig the, um, the pasta with the broccoli so we're going to make the sauce that goes with it on the recipe critic website they made uh, theirs with beef and I've made that before and the beef is really good but tonight we're making it with shrimp so here's everything that we're using on the table we have our black pepper we have ginger um, we have crushed red pepper we have the sesame oil we have brown sugar we have poison sauce um, but I use this one, the regular hoisin, and there's also one with the ginger. And we have our carrots, we have our shrimp, and we have our garlic, and we have our olive oil. And I, what I'm going to do now is cut up the, um, shred the carrots. So I will be back. Okay, so I'm going to, here are the carrots, and we just bought some baby carrots. And what we're going to do is just shred those in our little salad shooter. And you see right there. I love this, it works really well. So we put the carrots in here. And then we turn it on. Okay, sorry about that. We had an amber alert, so you may have heard a little bit of noise there. So, bless the child, whatever happened. Okay, so we're going to finish shredding this. Okay, so we're just going to take a fork. Or something and just take the rest of that out of there and so there we have our fresh shredded carrots okay okay now we're gonna put the shrimp in there it's already shrimp is already seasoned up And take our spoon and just kind of mix this around. Okay, and that's on medium, and we're just gonna let that cook till it's pink. Meanwhile, we're gonna go over here and we're gonna mix up our sauce that we're gonna pour on top of that. Okay, so while the shrimp is cooking, we'll go ahead and mix up all the ingredients. And I pre-measured everything. So right now we're gonna take the brown sugar. And I don't know what the measurements is offhand. I believe it's a quarter of a cup of brown sugar. So we're gonna pour that in the bowl. And then we're gonna pour in the pure sesame oil. And right now where our shrimp is cooking, so I'm gonna put the measurements on the YouTube video so that way you guys have it and also put it on our, um, on our website so that you can print it out as well. And so then we're gonna have, use the crushed pepper. We're gonna pour this in. 
Okay, then we have ginger, ground ginger. We pour that in. And then we have our black pepper. Pre-measured, pour that in. I ran out a little cup, so huh, using what I can. And then we're gonna pour, pour in the hoisin sauce. light soy sauce. It's a quarter of a cup of the light soy sauce. And just about out of that. Sometimes I add a little bit more. And either again the hoisin sauce, we have the garlic hoisin or the regular hoisin. I use either or. Sometimes I just add a little bit more in there. You know, I like to have a good amount of sauce on there. And so I take a whisk and I just stir it up. Make sure you guys can see me. So we're saving the garlic and the carrots for the shrimp. Okay? So we just stir this up really well, just mix it up. Go over and check on the shrimp. Okay, we're over here checking on the shrimp. Still need a little bit more cooking time on that. We have our temperature a little bit past the medium. So go ahead and let that cook. Mm-hmm. It's nice and pink. Okay. So this is ready. So we're just waiting on the shrimp to finish cooking. Take a peek at the shrimp. Okay, now it says add three cloves of garlic to the mixture. So I'm gonna add the garlic to the mixture and stir, mix it up. I'm also going to stir in the carrots. There's probably a whole lot of carrots, but I'm going to go ahead and stir those in. And we allow that to, to simmer, to cook a little bit for maybe about a few minutes. Let this cook for a little bit. Just a couple of minutes. Okay, so now we're going to take this mixture 
and we're going to pour it into the pasta. Oops, don't want that in there. to mix this up. Just mix all that up and if you did beef uh, or chicken you would just make sure that you have that all mixed up okay so now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take my sauce right here and I'm going to pour I just pour a little bit on at a time okay And then I mix it up. Okay, then I take some more sauce and I pour it on. And then I mix it up. So everything's already done. So all you're doing now is pouring the sauce on there and then it's gonna be time to eat. So just pour all this on. Mix it up really well. Okay, and then I pour some more of the sauce on. So I can I keep doing this. I keep pouring the sauce. And then I mix it up some more. Waste not want not. You know me. I'm always not wanting to waste anything okay then I'm mixing this up it's really quick this is really only like about a 20 or so minute meal there's not a lot of ingredients you can buy your carrots already shredded up if you want to I like to use my little shredder so I like to shred them up myself. And then we pour the rest of this on. I'm gonna go ahead and use the rest of it. Okay, with my wire whisk. And I'm gonna take this, get all of it out of there. See, almost all of it. And then we're just gonna stir that up some more to make sure that we get all of the noodles. Soaked and saturated. Okay, so then you know what I'm gonna do, right? I'm gonna put some in here. And I'm gonna swish that around. Swish, swish, really good. Put that back in there. You know me, waste not, want not. I like to get every little bit. And there you have it. Make sure I turn the stove off. And there you have it, our gourmet takeout garlic, shrimp, and broccoli lo mein. And we made it straight from our kitchen. There you go, nice and hot, ready for your family to eat. And I received this recipe from Facebook on a website called The Recipe Critic. It's about a 20 minute recipe. They make it with the beef. I just added shrimp this time. It's really good, you won't regret it. Make sure you sign up for, um, subscribe to our channel. And we try to upload videos daily. So if there's something that you wanna see, please drop us a note, a comment or anything, and let us know if you also tried the 
the recipe as well. Okay, thank you and have a good evening.